check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. Guess what? Today's video, first video of 2021. Can you guys believe it? Oh my god. Finally, 2020 is over, but seriously, who thinks that it's just a continued 2021? Or do you, are you in that mindset of, no, this year is going to be better. This year, you know, things are going to change and, you know, which, let me, first of all, which one are you? What do you think? I'm kind of on both sides. I'm like, yeah, we're still going to be in this whole pandemic thing. Hopefully it gets a little bit better, but this is the year. This year is going to be different. This year is definitely going to be a growth year. It is I mean, for myself, of course, this is what I'm, you know, where, where I'm at mentally growth year and doing better for myself, for relationship wise, for, you know, life, for my channel, for, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm for it all. That, that's basically it. I feel this is going to be a better year. <laughs> Fingers crossed. But anyways, how are we feeling? Did you guys get drunk? I didn't get drunk. I got some Stella Rosa. Yeah, in a can. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of the background? Loving it, hating it, lighting, good, bad. What do you think? I wanna hear the feedback. But anyways, today's video is going to be full face, first impressions, uh yeah full face first impressions first video of 2021 that's what this is so i'm actually if you guys want to see how i get this look the products that i use and if i enjoyed them if i did not fuck i gotta charge my camera again okay then please continue watching now let me show you um i actually found this brand on instagram they're not uh, expensive at all. I was going to say cheap. They're not expensive at all. And they work really well. Let me just show you guys uh, what I got. And what I'm going to be using for today's video. So I got from. It's this brand called Clarity Cosmetics. And it looks like this. So. Clarity Cosmetics. It's on Instagram. I will go ahead and put their Instagram in the um description box so you guys can check them out their stuff is really good really 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 good super super impressed this is one product that i got this is an empty z palette so it comes empty um like this and you can fit a lot of shades in here actually so this is one that i did pick up it is called purple rain and it is a foiled shadow and i will swatch it for you guys this shadow is so they're super super creamy and like pigmented super super pretty <laughs> i actually really really like their um foiled shadow formula it's really good the other one i got is called between the sheets it looks like this it's oh, gorgeous all right there that is between the sheets okay so that i got the next thing i have two eyeshadow palettes this one is called so it's supposed to be like choke but chocolate seduction palette by clarity cosmetics for the chocolate lovers the chocolate lovers palette so of course you know I had I had to get this one and this is what it looks like and it does come with a mirror and here is the palette the mattes do feel super creamy and like super soft see how <laughs> My arm, my arm goes sideways. Okay. So. 
All right, this one right here, the first shade is just a little bit. Tie me up, bite me. This is chocolate lollipop. This greenish one is chocolate eruption. Beautiful one right here. I love that shade. Is called caramel orgasm. Whips and handcuffs. Lick and nibble. Guilty pleasure. But yeah, so this is the palette, and this is actually the one I used on my eyes today. You guys see the glitter? Alright, so, Chocolate Seduction, and I believe, um, Clarity Cosmetics, cosmetics is actually on sale right now um some of these stuff and whatever is on sale what i um asked them this morning is whatever is on sale is stuff that will be discontinued and they won't ever have it back according to what i was told so if you go on their website and you do see stuff on sale um i would probably grab it there is a palette that i'm going to be getting it is called juicy peach and i want that one so 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 bad it's so pretty and these shade and um the foil shade carnival which is their newest one it's so gorgeous uh there's that one there's and like two other ones that are super super new and i want them so bad i want them the other palette that i got that was actually on trend mood is this one this is the vip private party and comes with a big mirror and these are these shades oh it's so gorgeous this i actually wanted to use for christmas and i did use it i just didn't record my look i used this shade here um code red on my bottom lash line smudged it out like crazy and then on the top i just did something simple simple brown like a nude and um yeah it was really really nice uh, nude on top uh in my crease and then some black liner and this smudge out on the bottom you can still see that brown under <laughs> penny champagne it's gorgeous like oh, look at that like that's just from swiping it off of here expensive taste and i used that one on my eye today too more towards the inner corner code red love struck cyclone what i like about this is that these shadows are actually little individuals and you can take them out of the entire palette every single shade you can take out of your palette and you can go ahead and put them in your c palette so there we go. Now I can put all of them in here. The only thing that I don't like about the fact that they come out is when you buy them in a single shade already by itself. It comes with their name and the sticker and stuff on the back. When you get it in the palette and you take it out of here, it does not come with the name on the back. So I wish that they still had the name on the back, but like if I wanted to take it out of here, a cream liquid lipstick and I got it in the shade Sugar Sugar. And um, it's supposed to be not a matte liquid lip. Um, it doesn't dry down to a full matte, but like it feels super comfortable and like you don't really have anything on. So this is, well, this is the box and this is what it looks like and a cute little doe foot applicator it's super messy but it is a super super cool tone and kind of like watery but still really pigmented and it has like a it has a scent to it and when I was putting it on I could not remember like what that is if you guys would like to see how I got this look how you know all the products worked 
and uh, what I enjoyed, what I didn't. Uh, if you guys would like to see all of that good stuff, then please continue watching and let's go. Uh, I base I'm going to use is my P. Louise of hair. Of course, I still absolutely love this one. It works so, so well and super full coverage. So let's go. Just a little bit for this orangey one. shade Bite Me, which is the dark chocolate. It sound right, boy. Um, just a little bit again, the first shade. The edges, but it's okay. Just very softly. I was just gonna go straight in right here, but I'm gonna carve out my crease first. And then we'll add the glitter because I want something a little tacky for it to stick to. I'm gonna dab into Bite Me. And tie me up just a little bit. Well, not just a little bit, but just <laughs> tie me up and bite me. Glitter right here, which is whips and handcuffs. Also gonna dip into expensive taste because you know we got it this has a little bit of a gold um, shift in it some gold flakes so it sound right boy Liner from Huda Beauty. Some lashes. I off of camera really quick and we will be right back finally I let my camera charge as much as I could but we gotta keep it going all right here we are eyes are done lashes on gorgeous lashes all right guys so unfortunately for this clip I did go ahead and not delete it but i had to take it out because um the foundation that i was using everything my skin was looking horrible so i took everything off and i reapplied it and that's what's going to be in our next clip um for my primer i went in again with the milani one
looks so much better. Then I used the uh, Born This Way Original Foundation in the shade Light Beige. This works so much better and my face looks completely different than when it did. I'm not sure which product it was, um, the niacinamine or the foundation. I don't know. I don't know which one it was, but I'm going to try them out again separately to see, you know, how my skin reacts. But different products, different foundations, different, you know, a mixture of items, which I usually do. Um, what do you guys think? Okay, so yeah, um, this foundation just looks so, so much better. I did go in again with the Milk um, Flex Concealer. This one is a little bit darker. It is golden, so it makes, you know, my skin look a little darker, but it kind of blended in um, fine. So that's not an issue. For the powder, I did have some other um, brand new powders but I didn't want to get up and get them so I went in with my um this one with this one the peach perfect from Too Faced uh, I love this powder it works so good it smells delicious if it gets in your mouth it tastes delicious don't eat it but I really really like it it is a mattifying powder so I like it uh, you guys know that the Physicians Formula did come out with a new butter bronzer, uh, a matte butter bronzer, and so I was about to get it, I swear, I was about to get it, but there was a longest line and I didn't want to wait in that long line for just one product, so I didn't get it, but I will be purchasing it um, within the next couple days, so I actually just went in with the original one, does the same thing, this one just has more of a sheeny um glow to it not a glow necessarily but like um it does have more like a sheen to it than the matte one so yeah this one you get like a little radiant glow sheen whatever word you want to use the other one is complete matte so you don't have the same thing but i absolutely you guys know i love this bronzer so 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 much i use it all the time can you hear the fireworks yeah that's what i'm dealing with so i absolutely love this bronzer and i cannot wait to try the matte one to see you know if it's if i love it the same more less the difference we're gonna go do the under eyes and i'm gonna use a tie me up Just a little bit. For our next matte shade, I'm gonna go with something a little smaller with Bite Me right here. It sound white, boy. Is the Moon Prism Blush from Lunar Beauty. Love, love, love this blush. I used it once or twice before. So, so good. I'm going to go in with Twilight and Stargaze. And I'm also going to dip a little bit into... So I went in with both of these. I'm going to dip a little bit into Spacey right here. I bought this in a BoxyCharm add-on and I still haven't used it. So this is the Kilowatt... Freestyle highlighter, I have Afternoon Snack and Mo Honey. And they look like this. We're just going to dip into both of them. Last things we need are the lips and setting spray we're good to go okay so i purchased this this is the cream liquid lipstick in the shade sugar sugar and it actually is 
darker and more cool tone than I thought it was going to be. So it's more of a purpley color. And they also sent me this for free. Their new uh, lip product. So it comes with a lip liner on one side. This side it comes with a lipstick right there so i'm actually not going to be using the uh, this um lip product from them but i guess we can do the one that i purchased um i'm also going to be trying out the ColourPop uh, lippy pencil in bff3 Supercharged, revitalizing facial mist. It smells so good. My, my camera is about to die right now. Oh, that smells so good. Alright. Charge real quick. We'll be back. All right, guys, real quick, um, I did have to charge my camera for just a little bit, so got to speed through this outro. Just to recap on everything that we used today, I absolutely loved the, <laughs> the eye products. I loved the Milani setting spray as well as the dewy primer. These worked really, really well, and I love um, how it just makes my skin feel really hydrated and super smooth at the same time. Um, it didn't, like, make my face look dry at all like the other one, the dang ordinary, the niacetamine. I think it was, I think that's what it was, um, honestly, but you know what? I, I can't say for sure until I try them out in different, with different products. So the other thing, um, the Milk um, Flex Concealer, I did say that this one was pretty good. The only thing is that I did get it in a shade too dark, but again, it's not a big problem. Foundation. Oh my god. I found another one, guys. This is another foundation to add to my list of my top foundations. I'm just going to say it. I'm just going to put it out there and I'm going to say that this is a good good foundation i mean from what i can see so far i've had it on for a couple hours now and my skin looks so so good this baby right here is a game changer if you have not got your hands on the lunar beauty moon prism blush palette definitely something worth the money these shades are beautiful the formula is amazing. It blends perfectly. It has that pigmentation that you want, but not too much. I swear, top blush product that I have used in a very long time. I'm gonna put it out there. I'm gonna say it and I can't take it back. 2020 blush palette. This one right here. This is the best blush palette in 2020. I would say drop the mic but I didn't want to drop the palette so you know there you go just saying now of course I wanted to try the matte bronzer but I didn't get a chance to get it I wasn't able to get it but I will be getting it within the next couple days like I said Colourpop still love it love it love it um this color is a little bit darker than my original one does this come off now <laughs> as a darker than the other one that I have the original BFF but I still really really like this one the formula is good it glides on perfectly it's creamy pigmented all of that good stuff and it's staying in place just saying amazing that is it for the first video back first video of 2021 and I am so so excited to get this year started to uh, you know 
hopefully grow my channel and put out more content and stuff that you guys you know want to see if there is ever anything that you guys do want to see any challenges any any anything honestly anything like that that you guys would like to see um please let me know i would love you know to create content and create videos that you guys would actually like to see so that you guys are interested in because i can go all day uh doing makeup looks i can go all day doing shopping hauls um so if that's if that's something that you guys like then let me know if there are other things that you guys would like to see please let me know because i would love to uh, make those videos but that is actually going to be it for today today's first video back and i swear i have so many ideas and so many videos coming this year i cannot wait cannot wait and hopefully you guys do enjoy the uh marble background it is gorgeous i think it's gorgeous and i love it love it so much the lighting in here is insane insane now and i love it i'm here for it i want to say thank you to my sister um uh, because she did get me the lighting uh for in here I used to just use my 12 inch uh ring light right here behind me but now I have my umbrella lights and now I have the stand to hold my backdrop my back the actual marble backdrop was another gift for somebody else but the act the stand was from her the lighting was from her and I'm so 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 happy with it it is a little bit confusing and I'm trying to figure it out on placement and trying to make sure that it's right because I can actually show you guys above me what it looks like like <laughs> yeah so I'm scared that I'm gonna hit that shelf and it's gonna fall and everything's gonna fall so I'm trying to figure out the positioning where I should be sitting because there isn't space right here in front of my vanity so yeah Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video and if so, don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you are not already, and don't forget to press that little bell so you are notified, shut up forever, so you are notified when I do upload a new video. With all that being said, I will see you guys in the next one.